What's up, mate? <laughs> trying not to fall down. <laughs> It'll be all right. Nothing broken. Uh, it's still fun, though. It's still fun. He hopped right back on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> let's get it, let's get it. <laughs> How much did you even pay for these things? When they first came out, I paid a thousand. But then for this one right here, I traded this guy a couple of 30 packs and some carton and some cigarettes, and he called it a deal. For real? Yeah. I got a good deal on this one. He, he didn't even have a charger. Yeah, he's one of our regulars. I was just looking on Facebook Marketplace. He listed it. I was like, a couple hey. 30 packs and a couple cards. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that works. Yeah. Ah. I see what you're talking about, though, when you said orange bikes. Oh, yeah. There's a whole bunch of orange bikes right here. I don't know if I can make it look good wiping out. You gotta make it look good, man. <laughs> Tuesdays. Fat Tuesdays in Austin. I gotta go there sometime. San Antonio. Oh, San Antonio. All around the Riverwalk area. Hell yeah. You've been there before? I've been to the Riverwalk. It's nice there. I gotta go when it's not like really hot though. They have a uh, fat Tuesdays or fat Thursdays. It's either Tuesday or Thursday, but I know it's fat. Okay. And they, it's right there in the mall. Yeah, so that's where we just stayed at. Case's Chick Kitchen. Crawfish A2 pay. Nike SP Dunk Low, $2,500 shoes. Yeah, those are clean. Supreme collab. No, Ben and Jerry's Oh, Ben and Jerry uh, collab. Yeah, ben and Jerry's Nike. Dunk, Nike SP Dunk Collab. It's clean. They were sexy. I'm my butt in them, bro. <laughs> Yo, these shoes you got on right now. They weren't too bucks. special, man. I got some, I got some, uh, <laughs> I got some more heat in my personal collection. Oh, yeah. Last sale was 466. Well, no, this is the other dude. I'll show you the shoes that look just like this, but those are the Travis Scott Fours. Lois asked is 1,100. That is in high demand then. I sold them for 950. Nice. And you caught them for like 200 bucks? No, I think I paid around 350 for those. That's still hella good. Look how much my size would be if I wanted a 12 and a half. Oh, wow. And then we click buy. And this is how I sell my shoes. Whenever I go to like the calculating thing, mm -hmm. like uh, it says it'd be 1,912 Ooh. stock. Like over time, the value of these shoes just keep going up. Yeah, it's literally like stock, man. And that's with every shoe. Like you can mm -hmm. look at a three month period. This is the best way to look at it. This is a six month period. And that's on stock X. And you can go all the way from uh, 2022, whenever they drop uh, and just keep going. Like they have peaks and then they go down. That's interesting. Uh, UNC is from one. And you'll never find them unless you go to a resale shop. Anniversary. Gosh. You'd have to go to a resale shop to even find them. And even then, like, I don't know if you've ever been to any resale shops. Have you been to, like, any of those in Dallas or anything? It's hard to find, though. Yeah, They're hard, very hard, hard to find. So that was a good skateboarding session with Nizzy. And if you like his sneakers that you were seeing 
he was sharing with me at lunchtime. Go check his Instagram page out. He's got lots of different kind of cool sneakers there. You learn something new. There's a lot of good deals to be had out there. There's a lot of supply and demand in the sneaker game. And whether you're just looking to boost your swag up by wearing cool sneakers or just looking to make a profit, go look into the shoe game. All right, thanks for tuning in and I'll see you on the next one. Peace. Hot, that, that, that.